So the times that we live in currently, there is nothing called a static image. Yes, everything is going to start moving and everything is already moving. Uh, your tom 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 of the Netflix. Everything has a sound, everything has a motion to it. As a teacher, I would say, since everything is moving, it becomes even more important that the student has, uh, or an individual or an artist or designer has a very individualistic standpoint. Otherwise, you'll get lost in this chaos of moving images. This is something again, my teacher told me once upon a time and when she told me, I didn't get it. But today I get it and I would repeat what she said. Uh, I think you have to be a storyteller. First and foremost. Uh, like, I, like I said, I could draw and I had seen Tom and Jerry, so I thought I could do animation, you know. But when I studied animation, I was told, Wo sab to hai, kahani sunana aata hai apko. you know. Uh, so the focus since that day has been in storytelling only. Uh, and I would say storytelling is the mother of animation. And uh, with the kind of things that are happening in the world in terms of technology and the democratization of animation, uh, what is it that you want to say will decide how you say it, you know. Um, you don't have to draw. You do not need prerequisites like drawing to be able to be an animator. You should have the knack to move things around. You should have the knack or the desire to give life to a, a bottle maybe, you know, or, or, or any other object, you know. That desire to make it move and how do you make it move uh, is what's going to work or not work. So, yeah.